Okay, I'm gonna target an individual. Sheree Dermans being targeted at Denver, Colorado at the moment. Sorry you guys, I've been catching my breath. <clears throat> oh, he's, I don't know Colorado very much, so I had lost my way around a little bit. But I'm catching my breath, because I was running, <clears throat> running like up the stairs. But I want to talk to you about something in case something happens to me and my children need to know the truth. We're going to talk about a perp that I was married to. His name is Darren Miller. He didn't turn perp until after the CPS Kayla Ellis targeted me. But I want to talk about him so my kids know the truth. Um, I've been holding back on this because, you know, as parents, we don't want to do parent allegations or, you know, alienate us from the other parent. But my kids need to know the truth because that's exactly what he did. When CPS targeted me, he was all for it. He was all for it because he would get the boys and no more child support would be paid. But I'm here to tell my boys the truth. Because he tried to tell my son some bullshit lies. Aiden Miller, my youngest son. He tried to tell him that I didn't want him. A bunch of bullshit, you know. A bunch of bullshit. He said I didn't want him. And uh, Darren Miller, I'm here to tell the truth, motherfucker. Because whatever I got is the truth. You and that Jigaboo CPS worker in that Jigaboo courtroom and the judge was involved. And I'm gonna get his name. Because I'm gonna report him. Because guess what, motherfucker? United Nations is looking into this. And I want to report all of you. So, because you're not behind me, motherfucker. You're for that CPS worker. I don't care. She, she hired this attorney, attorney, or lawyer for you. Sorry, I can't speak right sometimes. She hired that lawyer for you. And I know that's the truth. Because your family didn't do that when we got a divorce. How come your family didn't do that when we got a divorce? Because you were on your own. But that lawyer made it look like your family paid for it. And all these years I thought that. But I ain't stupid. Sheree, what? <laughs> she wisened up. Wisened up. To the stupidity that has been told to her. You, you motherfucker, are in trouble. You could either be on my side and tell our sons, our boys, and Nakomi the truth of what you did, or you could fall down with Kayla. The choice is up to you, you. Because guess what? If you don't, did you see United Nations, motherfucker? You're going to get, what is it called? Crimes Against Humanity. Do you want that charge on you? Or do you want to tell the truth? Because you told our boys lies. You sat there and kept those boys from me maliciously to hurt me. That's what you did. To maliciously hurt me. And I'm here to speak the truth every day. So you, Darren Miller, the person I was married to for nine years, could either tell the truth or I'll tell the truth and you'll get a charge. Do you want that charge? Crimes against humanity? Do you want that charge, Darren Miller? Because I'm speaking the truth to you. 
and I'm telling my boys the truth, what you did to their mother. I always told people you're a, a bad husband, but a good father. But a good father does not do this to their mother. You're a bad father. No one does this to their fucking mother. That's a bad dad on your part. And you either can speak the motherfucking truth or you can spend the rest of your life in prison. I don't give a fuck at this point. Because I'm here every day out here that I spent one day in a homeless shelter. I'm gonna fucking speak the truth of what you did, Kayla Ellis did, and anybody who else had a part in it. Like Carissa B. We all know that she doesn't want that charge. But she's so in love with uh, Jeremy Hauser, Nevaeh's dad. She's willing to take that charge. Are you willing, Chris Bean? Willing to take down a charge with crimes against humanity? Are you willing to speak up on my behalf and on your kids' behalf? Think about it. Because it's coming down, Carissa. Because I ain't the bitch to be fucked with in life. Sorry. Bye.